Hi everyone, I'm Caleb and you're watching Caleb Zambum Vlogs and Tech. In this video, I want to talk about the coronavirus and how the coronavirus will impact this YouTube channel. I want to let you know that this video is general advice only. I'm not a medical professional. If you do require advice, I'd recommend you do consult a medical professional. I want to talk a bit about the coronavirus. I want to educate you viewers about what it is, um, how it affects you, how you can get it, what you can do about it, what's happening around it. Not for clout, not for views, none of that. Let's get started. So, throughout this video, I'm going to be screen sharing a few articles from relevant organizations. Before I go into any detail, I want to actually give you guys the definition on what coronavirus is. I've got an article here from the World Health Organization. Let me give you a bit of a rundown. Coronavirus is a large family of viruses that cause illnesses ranging from the common cold to a more severe disease. You can see you've got specific ones there. Now, the, co the coronavirus disease, the COVID-19, is a new strain that was discovered in 2019 that has not been previously identified in humans. So, common signs that of the infection of coronavirus COVID-19 include fever, cough, shortness of breath, breathing difficulties, and in more severe cases, infection. So with us just looking here, we can see that there was a fair amount of standard recommendations to prevent, include regular hand washing, covering of mouth and nose when sneezing, thoroughly cooking meat and eggs, avoid close contact with anyone showing symptoms. So pretty much anybody that's showing any of these symptoms, you're to avoid close contact with them is pretty much what they're saying. This article here is from the Australian Government, the Department of Health. This is pretty much what you need to know about coronavirus, COVID-19. There's pretty much an illness by a new virus. We scroll down, it gives you some symptoms as we can see. Um, and as I said, if you think you have coronavirus, there is a information hotline here that you can ring 24 hours a day. They are great. And you can seek medical attention if you have symptoms or travel history as well. If you've been to China or any country, now I believe Australia last week or a few days ago, they announced that anybody coming to Australia, regardless whether you've been to a country that's had the outbreak or not, you need to have two weeks quarantine. A lot of events being cancelled at the moment um, due to coronavirus. It's as here from the Royal History Show to the Wiggles, and we're going to go into that a bit later. Uh, should you worry? about the coronavirus and then again um, Ill Ill illnesses due to coronavirus is generally mild so it's so it's pretty much majority of it's mild but it says here one in five people that catch it need hospital care so overall it's very mild virus but if it gets severe you're pretty much stuffed. The next point that I want to raise across is about the cancellation of events. We can see here this is an article from The Guardian They've put the headline, it's from the Royal Easter Show to the Wiggles list of Australian events cancelled due to coronavirus. So pretty much you've got sport, entertainment, arts, food festival, they've all been affected by the pandemic. You've got stuff from NRL, AFL, Super Rugby, Basketball, Vivid. You've got stuff like Sydney Riders Festival, Royal Easter Show, concerts, losing fingers here. You've got, what are, you've got tours, you've got Luna Park as well, they're temporarily shutting down. A lot of people are posting on Twitter about the situation and these are just some notices about um, specific organizations cancelling events. We can see in media releases, people are cancelling events, people are concerned regarding the coronavirus. But overall speaking, it's, the vlogs are going to be affected. Um, the vlogs are going to be affected indefinitely regarding to all of these events being cancelled. We were going to vlog NRL games, Vivid, Easter Show, to name a few. All of them are literally, what am I going to do to vlog? That's going to be the next question. Even with the panic buying, so many people have been panic buying for nothing. Uh, this was last week. This was, a, this was at my local Woolworths. This is toilet paper. Toilet paper is bare. We go to the next slide. We've got tissues here. No tissues. Pasta and rice, zero. This is the customer notice that Woolworths put out. We're literally selling, they are literally selling toilet paper. This one was bidding on eBay. For my mum, for example, earlier today, eight o'clock this morning, she went to Woolworths. The lines, I was not there, but she took some video on that, showed me. The lines were insane. There was 52, there was about 50 people in front of her waiting in line before this store even opened. You can see here, people are bidding on eBay $20,000 for toilet paper. You've got to be joking. Um, who, like, logically, who would pay 
$20,000 for toilet paper. I hope this is a joke. I hope that this is a joke. One thing I want to point out though is that with regards to YouTube and Google, um, one thing as well, there's a lot of companies such as Google, Amazon, Microsoft, Telstra, major of the telcos, all of that. They are all limiting staff. So guys, YouTube, YouTube are very transparent about what they're saying. Let's take a look here on Twitter with what they said. With fewer people to review content, our automated systems will be stepping in to keep YouTube safe. More videos will be removed than normal at this time. Including content that does not violate our community guidelines. So, as I said, as that Google rep said a few hours ago when I spoke to her, YouTube, Google, they are limiting staff. If there's less humans, they will rely on automation. YouTube literally admitted, including content that does not violate our community guidelines. They've got less humans reviewing content. They rely on automation. YouTube is going to go down to no fault of our own. I, I wouldn't be surprised if this video got removed due to this tweet. This tweet right here. I would not be surprised. This is why, guys, you go to the place to be. CalebTempleman.com As I said, this video and this information is general advice only. If you require more information or if you're curious or if you want to know more information, Dial the Coronavirus Health Information Line. You can reach them 24 hours a day, 7 days a week for information about COVID-19. You can reach them at 1-800-020-080. Guys, that is about it for this video. And if you want more information regarding coronavirus, I recommend you guys go to check out those links. Um, and also to go check out calebtempleman.com for future updates regarding coronavirus and also other news than that guys thank you for watching and i will see you all in the next video also by the way guys more information about this will be published at government.com so i recommend you go check that out thank you for watching